Still Saturday, December 21st, 2013, and the last video of the day, but it's going to be my favorite. It's the 1980 Dodge Macho Power Wagon from Simon & Simon. Um, I have, like I said, I've heard of the show, just don't uh, ever recall seeing it. So we're going to go ahead and crack this. Uh, this is the worst one of the bunch. You can see there's a little, little tear right there, a little uh, on the edge. Whenever, whenever you buy these cases, you're going to get probably one or more that's got little issues with it. So they don't really, uh, you know, they're, they just ship them in a hot little box. And for me, that's fine because I only crack, you know, at least one of every one. So this one is probably not the same weight as this Dodge. I'll tell you that Dodge is heavy. That little uh, SRT is. But this is all an all metal base. Rubber tire with tread. I love the big wheels on it. All of the Hot Wheels, when they do the, the, the lifted trucks, I think they look sweet. I don't know. Even if they're not realistic, I just really like them for some reason. Big old bumper there. They do have a painted license plate on the front there. They didn't paint the. No, yeah, they did. No, maybe they didn't. No, they didn't. I, I was going to see if they painted the winch, but they do have painted headlights. Kind of hard to see from this video. Um, and then, of course, you've got your power wagon, all your little emblems on the on the back, on the sides there. Painted uh, roll bar lights. Pretty sweet there. In the back, you've got painted tail lights. Even though it is red, they did use a uh, a different shade of red to paint them, which a lot of times they don't. Painted uh, door handles. Got the license plate back there as well. Of course, you get the big power wagon logo. Other side's going to be the same, and you do have the little footsteps there. And then the bed, nice detail. Although they could have painted that little red part black there. That would have made it look more realistic, I think. This is plastic, this was metal, so that's why they didn't, but that eh, could be touched up real easy if you wanted to. But they do have the roll bar on the inside painted black. Huh. And it looks like what they've done, you can see a little error right here, a little yellow. On this side you can see it on the top of the door too, it looks like the tampo just kind of overlapped. Anyway, still my favorite. It's a big truck. Look at that thing. Get this little white paint flake there from Herbie off. Might have to raise the camera up a little bit. This thing's a honking beast. There we go. So we're not looking up at it. Luckily, that's the one I got four of. I didn't know. I thought it would be four of the SRT8 or the what you call it, the Star Trek. So that's really going to do it for this one, and probably for the day. Um, might be able to make one tomorrow. I don't know. I'm going to have the uh, grandson this evening again. Had him all weekend last weekend. That's why I didn't make any videos then. And uh, whenever he's around, I don't, uh, I don't mess with anything else. Can't wait until he can really get into these. He's too small right now, so that's kind of why I started these because I knew he was on his way. And uh, I've got a ton of cars for him already, quite a couple thousand at least, I think, something like that. And they're all cracked. You know, he's going to destroy them and do whatever he wants to with them, and that'll be fun. And we'll uh, hopefully be able to do the hobby together one day. So. That's it. Questions or comments, post those below. Subscribe, and thanks for watching.